Hello, and what we're going to look at in this little video is a, the Google Arts and Culture app. So you can see this on my phone here. You can see this guy right here, Arts and Culture. This is also available for Android. So even if you're using an iPhone, an iPad, an Android phone, or an Android tablet, you have access to this app. So I'm going to open it up. And some of you may have used this before, previously. Uh, you can come in here and you'll see that Google spent a lot of time scanning different uh, cultural and artwork from around the world. But recently they added a new little feature to this app that's became very popular. If I scroll down to my app a little bit, I'm going to see, is your portrait in a museum? This is kind of a neat little app to use with your students. Uh, if you're looking for a little kind of time filler or something to allow them to explore artwork from around the world, uh, this is kind of an easy way to do so. So I'm going to start this and you're going to see what it looks like. Now, just to warn you, at some point it's going to turn my camera on and so you're actually going to see me. So I just don't want to scare you. So I'm going to click get started. When I do that, it just comes in and kind of explains to me how this is going to work. What it does is it basically scans your face and tries to match it to famous artwork from around the world. So I'm going to click I accept. We can see there's me. Now we'll try to get a decent selfie here. It comes through and explains to me what I'm supposed to do. But if I just swipe that close, I can see who it matches me up with. All right. So you can see here I'm a 61% match to the portrait of Carl Van Molari. If I click his face, it'll actually give me the full portrait and an explanation of what it is. Or I can click uh, view artwork. Now I can swipe on here to see what other matches I possibly have. Now I've done this a couple times and I found that uh, each time I do it, sometimes I get a couple different uh, art portraits according to how well I take the uh, selfie picture. Uh, so you, you can have students try it a couple times, but it's kind of a fun little activity that you can do. Now maybe you'll go through here and you'll find one that you want like, so maybe I want to keep that one. I can click share. And then I can save the image, I could send it in a message or a hangout, I could add it to my Google Classroom. There's lots of different things that I could do. So once again, just a real kind of fun activity that you can do with students. Uh, if you're looking for something to help them explore art, if you're looking for just kind of a fun team building activity uh, and having all the students kind of scan things up in the front, uh, it, it's definitely kind of a cool thing to do. So that's the Google Arts and Culture app and then using the is my uh, portrait in a museum. Thanks for watching.